Hey MVPs, Rico Notes here. Going to talk to you guys about prize picks tonight. To be honest, when I look at the prize picks, I'm going to make this video free. I don't like a lot of the lines in prize picks. I really don't. When I look at Kyron Drones passing yards, I feel really comfortable betting on the 150. The 224 seems really high. 185, if I had to bet. If I had to bet, I would probably take the over in this, but it doesn't feel something I could parlay at all. Thomas Castellano, same thing. You, you feel good about the 150. So if they were to give me 150 here, I would have been good, but they're not. They're giving me 175. I hate that. Cost, Castellanos at 150 feels right, but I still just don't like it. I just don't like any of it. I mean, it's possible they hit the overs, but I'm just not going there. And the reason for this is I think they're going to both be under duress by the pass rush. And I just don't see a lot of passing yards in this game, personally. Rushing yards, A.J. Turner, 85 yards feels pretty good. Um, I think he's going to break. So I actually like the 85. Let me see. What, what's the – a? can you do that singular or you got to pick something else with it? You got to at least do two? Yeah. I think I wouldn't swing for the fence here and just go 85. I don't like Freddie Brock at 53, though. I can tell you that right now. And I don't know if I want to ruin your night and just tell you take the under. And that could, that could be a bet. Like, that could be a bet right there. I don't think Freddie Brock's going to do his thing against Marshall tonight. I love Freddie, but I think this is more realistic. The 40. 40 or an under feels a little better. Maybe the 40 gives you less room for failure, right, instead of the under. 40 gives you that, and you're cheering for him. But you might just be so frustrated when Georgia State doesn't run the ball tonight. <clears throat> By Shaw Tootin, 94. It's a lot of carries. That's a lot of carries. He's going to get about five yards a carry. You need 25 carries. You need 20 carries, 19 carries. So that's a lot of carries. If you think he's going ham, then more power to you. 70. I don't see the value in this, in this being a green. There's not a lot of advantage here compared to the Freddie Brock one. There just isn't. But, you know, he's been getting ridden pretty good. I like Kyron Drones at 25. They don't give me that option. Can he go over 50? Yes, he can. So I wouldn't even bet on this. I just wouldn't. Thomas Castellanos, I actually like him under. I think he's going to be under duress all night, but he can embarrass you and get over 33 in one carry, so it's very scary. The only, the only thing I even like here is Turner, but once again, I'd probably go Green Goblin on this shit. Green Goblin, and you're not making much money with these bets, right? The Green Goblin, dude. What do you got to do? You, it's 20 for 44, so you're just flipping a unit. Oh, it's a unit flip? Hey, that's a hell of a unit flip. There you go. There's a prize picked unit flip right there. Flip a unit. Just three three goblin dudes. Hey, I don't mean to drag out this video because this is going to be free, but I'm going to uh, cut that one up and post it somewhere. I don't know where I'm going to post it. File. I shouldn't do that. doesn't even matter. The video is free. You guys can see it. All those lazy people who don't want to watch the videos. Yeah, they're the ones. Receiving yards. Fitzpatrick. I like him a lot. I think he, there's a mismatch there. He's got the height, the size. They throw it to him often. He gets targeted a ton. But 46 is a big number for him. It really is. He usually is in that in that range, and they don't give you any leverage here. 39 and 46, there's there's no way you take the 39. There is no way you take the 39. you got to sit there at 46 and feel good about it and just hit more. You have to. There's no other way to bet this. Fitzpatrick Moore. Now, is it going to happen? I don't know. Doran Fleming, I don't like his 33. I would take less. 24 feels realistic, but I would probably take less at 33. He needs about five receptions to get to 33 with the way he runs routes and the way they utilize him. Ted Hurst, good number. It's usually where he's around. Pfft, that should hit. He should get 50 yards. So... The, the rest is kind of swinging for the fence. Gosno. Gosno gets targeted less than his brother. Where's his brother? Steven right here. So, eh. I don't, I don't even know if I like Steven at 30. Oof. Leading receiver. Obviously, Jaden Skeet's been getting his yards lately. I love Jaden Skeet, but I don't want anybody. Be careful. Like, 24 is cool. See that? You get, you get fucking... How many yards you get in between that? 14. As opposed to... This shit, six, seven yards. You get double. Yeah, I would go Jaden Skeet all day before I bet on Fitzpatrick. Jaden Skeet with the little green guy, that's a better bet to make. Let's see what they give you for Jalen Lane. They don't even give you the option, just 41. Ugh. What about Lewis Bond, 39? Oh, that's a hell of a bet. That's pretty good. You can just do those two and flip a unit. Oh, it's 14, 20 to 14. All right, not quite a unit flip. 
There's your unit. There's your unit. A little more than a unit. That looks like a really good bet to make as well. Jaden Skeet, Lewis Bond, and Ted Hurst, all the Green Goblins. It's playing it safe. I don't see any other value I like here. Receptions, not in this game. Touchdowns, A.J. Turner probably going to score one. Probably. He doesn't. He only has two on the season, so I don't know about that. I don't like any of these other guys scoring touchdowns. Maybe Fitzpatrick wins a jump ball, and he's a Red Devil at one. That's a pretty good bet. Let's just say that I'm not going six deep on this. Let's just be real. That's a good bet, Fitzpatrick. I would I would go there and just keep your fingers crossed that it works out for you. Tootin's going to score one at least, and Fitzpatrick's got a shot to win a jump ball. He's got a shot. Wouldn't bet on Dorian Fleming. Probably stay away from Freddie Brock. Ted Hurst has a possibility he wouldn't go there. Don't like any of these guys to score. They eventually, I mean, they could, but I wouldn't bet on it. Treshawn Ward. Probably has a better chance than some of the receivers. Castellanos, Kentucky didn't go. But obviously, this is this is a bet. Can you do this by itself? Or you need more people? You need something else, huh? Ugh. Oh, you might want to go back to a yard. Pick one of them Green Goblin yard guys. Yeah, I would go pick one of these Green Goblin yard guys. And just... What's Hurst at? 49? I said I liked Hurst and his value or Skeet at 24. Yeah, either one of these guys. What is that? That's making 20 into 90. Yeah, that's a hell of a bet tonight. But you got you need Tootin to go for two touchdowns. So just a little scary all the way around on the touchdown side of the house. Passing touchdowns. I wouldn't bet on these. I wouldn't. You can think you're going to get two touchdowns from each of these guys. You'll be severely disappointed. Hope it works out for you. I don't see it like that. Vegas doesn't see it like that. Interceptions. Oof. I hate I hate sitting there hoping an interception occurs. I really do. Thomas Castellanos can't throw, but he's only thrown what? Two interceptions all season? No, four. He's thrown four? Two last last game. They were Hail Mary type stuff. They're gonna be trailing, he'll be throwing a lot. That's it's something to think about. That's that's crazy. They're making money on these guys. They're making money on these. Okay, pass rushing yards. Thomas Castellanos, 222. Kyron Drones seems a little high for me. That seems a little high. I'm hoping he throws for 150, rushes for, for 50, or even 25. That seems like a really big number to me. Kyron Drones. Seems a little high. I wouldn't bet on it. Castellanos, he better get something. I, I, I'm on the under. I'm kind of, I think he gets frustrated and handled tonight. <sighs> like love. I like love. I like love. I know he can kick field goals. I know he can kick field goals. I like love over. Hey, I would, man, I'm on a whole nother level here. I like John Love. What up, Johnny John? All in all, not a great night for prize picks. Got to be a little creative. Careful. Take your time. Don't go too overboard. These aren't, This isn't a night to go deep or anything like that. They didn't miss anything. Maybe Skeet, the green goblin for Skeet, seems fucking free. And same with Hurst. Those two feel really good. And then I would probably add other things to it from everywhere else. Whatever other play you like. One Red Devil, one Red Devil, one Red Goblin, one Red Goblin. Um, so I'd probably make like five bets with these. And then a bunch of other things. But good luck, MVPs. It's prize picks, bro. Peace.